A proud moment for those gathering to watch Japan's historic moment in space exploration. The country's space agency says its smart lander for investigating moon, or SLIM, has successfully had a soft landing on the lunar surface. SLIM uh, has um, been communicating uh, to the Earth uh, uh, station and it is um, receiving command from um, the Earth. It makes Japan the fifth nation to touch down on the moon. All systems are broke. But while the launch and touchdown was successful, latter parts of the mission might not be completed. Slim solar panels were not generating electricity for the spacecraft, possibly because of how they're angled. It forced the teams to act some of its functions, like the heater, so it can run on battery power for a few hours. Even if the battery runs out and uh, the, the, uh, the Slim uh, um, they loses um, um, all power, uh, if um, the panel catches sunlight, then um, it will um, uh, restart. It could take as long as a month for the solar angles to change. In most cases, your um, other energy source is not going to last that long because photons are free, you know, so solar uh, power is going to be the dominant mechanism of power. JAXA officials are still collecting data to confirm whether another part of the mission was successful. SLIM was equipped with precision landing tools and it was aiming to land within a 100-meter target. The hopes are for this tech to be used in future space missions, as Japan has teamed up with the Canadian, American, and European space agencies as part of the Artemis missions. This is part, then, of wider attempts to try and have efficiency savings and marginal gains uh, in trying to make the moon more accessible. Landing in precise locations could help scientists get closer to parts of the moon to determine if water is on the surface and if it is habitable for human life. Kyle Benning. Global News.